Welcome. So I'm going to show you how to undertake a reverse H lookup in Excel as a follow-up to the reverse V lookup equivalent methods which I showed you in a previous video. In this first example, I'm going to show you how to perform a reverse H lookup on some financial market data. As the following will show you, we can I'm sure we can do a, a standard V look H lookup for today's market close data as the following H lookup will testify to. For our CAC, Kosky and Nikkei, the challenge is to undertake a reverse H lookup of this data for the previous market close. The first approach using the lookup combined with the search function will be able to execute on this request accurately and without fail. As we can see, we are referencing the correct number for our yesterday's close for CAC, COSPI and the Nikkei. This is our first approach that we can use. In the second approach, we're going to use an index match in this second approach, it is just as seamless as the first approach, combining an index, referencing the data array from previous close by applying the match function to pick up the specific market that we want to reference. Example, showing this a further time, we look at this phone bank market data. Again by using the lookup and search approach, we'll be able to reference the EBITDA margin, which is actually above the line of countries, as in the following illustration. Again, as I've discussed in previous videos, it's imperative that the arrays of data correlate with each other, otherwise we'll get the wrong answer. There we have it. That is the approach under the lookup search function. Under the second approach, again, we're going to use the index match approach. Similarly, the index match, we're referencing the EBITDA margin, which is the data we want to reference, by combining the match function to reference the respective country for these two, three countries, Australia, Italy and the Philippines.